Carl Summer, president of Reliable EVM, has a wealth of machining experience. Having worked as a machinist, tool and die maker, foreman, tool designer, and operations manager, Carl now shares with you from his wealth of experience. I'm standing on the table of this Sinker EDM. The table is larger than a ping pong table, to give you an idea. And this tank over here, what you see where my foot is standing, that rises and it fills up with oil up to 53 inches. And it takes an enormous amount of oil. It takes over 64 barrels of oil. We have a sample over there of the oil that it holds. So it's an enormous machine. It travels in the X, 61 inches, in the Y, 108 inches, and Z that travels 39 inches, up and down. And so we see there's all kinds of capabilities with this Sinker EDM. Now what makes Sinker EDM very special is that this Z axis also has a rotary axis. And also we have the normal X axis and the Y axis. But all four axes can move at the same time. And there's all kinds of capabilities for that. So because of that, we can make all kinds of shapes round. We can put a hole in this way. We can make all kinds of spiral shapes into metals. These are some of the electrodes that we use in this Sinker EDM. Let's take a close up. There's a long electrode. You can see the cross sections of it. And here's a rotary electrode, as you can see. And this one actually rotates down goes down into the piece, or like this here. Let's take it and rotates and actually makes those kind of grooves. Now here's some large electrodes. Here's a long electrode that we use to make key rays. Here we use this here side, and there's also one on this side. Here's another tall electrode, but we mounted that on a piece of aluminum, and that's, we had to do some kind of tall EDME into a part. This is a rather unique part. Now our Z-axis holds up to 3,300 pounds. And so we could put enormous electrodes on that C-axis over here. And this one went into a, a sort of a cube type that had holes in it, where we had to go into that hole and then we had to take out some EDM on this side and then inside, inside. In other words, we made another cavity inside the hole and also turn it upside down. We had to go inside on the top and also both sides. Here we have this tall part in this EDM machine. Here are some other tall parts. We have RAM EDM and some of our other EDM machines. One of the unique features of the RAM EDM is the ability to orbit. A lot of times we will orbit in a, an electrode to put threads into a hardened piece of material or any type of material that's very difficult to machine or maybe a deep hole that needs threads. Uh, so we, we, get, we have an existing electrode that has the threads in it, has the pitch in it, and then we would drop this electrode in the hole. So the, the pre-drilled hole needs to be the drill size of the tap. Drop the electrode in it and you would lock the Z and just orbit around until you get the desired depth of the threads in the hole. And you can put any kind of thread in, threading uh, electrode in there. This is a 5 16 24. It's a fine thread. We even have like 1032 electrode. Any kind of threads. This is actually an Acme thread for a very specialized thread. And again, you can put that in any type of material that's hard, very difficult to machine. Another thing we can do is the, take an electrode here and we can hold this and then move it in X, Y, and Z. And so we can burn in any type of plane, any type of angle, and rotate it in C and then go back and do an, another X, Y, and Z burn. And so any type of multi-directional cavity can be accomplished with the RAM EDM. A customer wanted to connect two cavities of this large valve. The electrode went in at an angle. 
Sinker EDM also works at one spark at a time, but it works out of the bottom. So this entire surface is sparking. And so you're gonna be watching now, we're gonna look at a video of this electrode beginning to EDM apart. Notice the up and down motion of the sinker EDM. The electrode does not touch the part. It's the sparks are jumping rapidly from the electrode to the part. To remove the eroded particles to bring in fresh oil, the Sika EDM keeps pecking along. And so you have that hydraulic pressure occurring. Imagine the hydraulic pressure that occurs from a part this size going up and down in the cavity. So the parts have to be bolted down. Incredible sinker EDM. We recently received this here part in our company, and unfortunately, we have this here large EDM machine here, sinker, and we were able to do the work in it. Here you can see the smoke arising from the electrode going into that cavity. My son, who is a mechanical engineer, and I wrote this book, Complete EDM Handbook. You can purchase it, but it's also free on our website. It's loaded with all kinds of EDM information. Located in the heart of the high-tech energy capital of the world, Reliable has the largest EDM job shop capabilities in North America, specializing nationwide in wire, RAM, and small hole EDM. Our commitment to our customers and our passion for technology has made us the EDM specialists.